Hi everybody, so uh, today we have a little cook up in the woods and uh, we're gonna cook uh, moose soup. Moose soup, uh, that moose come from uh, our uh, hunting trip in 2021, so last fall, a few months ago. Uh, I had a uh, bull only license and I killed uh, that nice uh, bull. We didn't make a video of that, uh, we had the friends hunt with us and uh, I mean, there was a lot of work and we got invited by two of our friends to go with them. And uh, so I didn't bother to bring the camera. We used the camera the first two days. The first day it was just me and Andrea. And the second days uh, our friend Bill was there. But after that, we didn't bring the camera with us. We just took a bunch of pictures. So the first day that we, we started hunting, it was just me and Pat and it was really foggy wet kind of day uh, but we always go anyway just in case you never know what you're gonna see so we crossed the road from our trailer that's where we went to the first day and we went up there and we did uh, some scouting and some calling uh, we didn't see too much And then the second day, Bill came with us yeah. and we went out to another spot that's, uh, you know, quite a hike to get to. And it was even better. It was a <laughs> beautiful <laughs> yeah. morning. Yeah, it yeah. was. And we got up there and, uh, you know, same thing. We did some scouting, some calling. Uh, there wasn't much around and except for bird feeding. <laughs> there was some very friendly gray jays <laughs> that I made friends with, and uh, you know they got quite close. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So day three, uh, one of our friends that has a cabin down where our trailer is invited us to go across the river because Joe. Joe yeah <laughs> Joe is 70 68 Jesus 68, he's gonna kill you yeah he's, uh, <laughs> he's like a billy goat he's in excellent shape he's jumping over the rock he's climbing up uh, the alders and jumping over the thick of moor like he's a little bunny rabbit <laughs> it's better shape better shape than us <laughs> <laughs> so we went there we didn't uh, we've never been there before to hunt so it was a great uh, opportunity for him so we crossed the river with our quads and then we parked them and then we hiked up to the mountain. Um, you know, it was incredible up there. We're up on a big rock face. Yeah. Oh yeah. Got and some nice picture of four of us on top of the mountain. Yeah. That was beautiful. It was. We could see for miles and miles and miles. Yeah. And I mean, uh, I think we could see Placentia Bay on the other side from where we were. I think yes. Yeah. yeah. yeah it was amazing. The yeah. scenery was crazy. We saw a bunch of moose, not a bunch of moose, we saw two moose two yeah. different times, but they were just too far because things when you're up there seem, you know, this big, but the, in reality, <laughs> it's yeah. a couple of kilometers. Yeah, it was far. <laughs> too far for us, and we're not the type to try. If we don't know we can get them and kill them, we don't, uh, you no. know, we don't do that. Yeah, and, uh, and then the fourth days, another of our friend, Kevin, he uh, invite us in the country. We did a long quad ride. Deep it was country, kind very of remote. Like, yeah, cabin. and it was kind of like no trail. So we just uh, follow Kevin. Kevin know the area since since he's young. He's going there, and uh, anyway, we uh, we got there and uh, we saw uh, four or five moose when we got at the bottom of uh, one of the big mountain, and uh, but they ran over and they passed over the mountain, so we lost them. And uh, anyway, uh, we got separate and Bill and Kevin went on one side and I was walking and I saw a bull coming back. He was on top of the mountain. 
it was uh, 405 yards. So uh, I lay down on the rock and uh, I took a shot and uh, I got him, perfect shot, vital. So the moose turned around, he walked about 15 feet and uh, he stopped and I gave him another one and right in the neck and he went down right there. Now Kevin said, I don't know how we're gonna get that moose. He said, I think, uh, I think we're gonna need a helicopter to go on top of the mountain to go get the moose. But uh, like I said, Kevin know the area very well. So uh, we walked, me and Andrea walked to the moose and Bill went straight up to the mountain. And um, it was quite a hike, it was quite a, yeah. a vertical climb. And Kevin has a little cart behind his quad and he went around and he managed to, he said he's gonna go close as he can with the squad. And he got on top of the mountain with his quad right beside the moose. <laughs> so, so, yeah. We're very surprised when we got there to see him already there. <laughs> yeah, he was there before us. So that was uh, that was uh, easier to, it was still a lot of work because uh, on the way down, the trailer was very tippy and there's no trail. We was going down the hill. So I was walking behind the trailer and managed to make sure the trailer don't tip. And uh, anyway, we got the moose out that day. It was a long day. We left yes. in the dark in the morning and uh, we came back, I don't know, it was like 5.30, 6 o'clock. Yeah. It was not dark, but it was close to dark. So it was a long day, but it was a beautiful day uh, where the moose went down. It was on the top of the mountain. We had a view. I mean, the pictures are nice, but you know, they don't show the reality of that. It was, uh, it was beautiful. We're lucky to live in Newfoundland where we have such beautiful scenery. Oh, yeah. We have such beautiful landscape. We have rivers, we have ponds, we have ocean, we have mountains, we have We have everything. a pond like right <laughs> behind us <laughs> with uh, moose, uh, moose soup. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, we hunt, that was uh, Tuesday, so that was day four. Mm -hmm. And uh, we hunt uh, Wednesday, Thursday, very hard. Did a lot of mileage we walk and walk and walk in the wood it was not a lot of moves it was hard it's and our hardest hunt it's yeah. our hardest hunt yet yeah and uh finally on friday morning it was pouring rain uh, we decided to go anyway but we decided to go with the truck just driving gravel roads here and there and after maybe i don't know two or three hours driving we finally saw a cow on the side of the road and uh, Bill took a shot. It was his first moose, a nice big cow. So uh, very happy. That was uh, that was fun for him. Like the first, the first animal you are ever harvest is always uh, something. And it was fun for us too to see. Oh, yeah. Because it's always so exciting when you kill your first animal. Oh yeah. I remember my first moose and the excitement and the yeah the <laughs> buck fever. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, he had it. <laughs> it was shaking. <laughs> <He did. laughs> yeah, that was cool. But yeah, so that was our uh, hunting uh, 2021. Um, I still regret that we didn't carry the camera the whole time, but not, that's it. Not me, we were busy making <laughs> memories, and we have lots of pictures. And you know, yeah. to take a bunch of cameras and GoPro, it's, uh, you know, it's a bit cumbersome, it takes more time, you need to set up. Yeah. And uh, Joe would have been to the top of the mountain back again before we got our camera set up. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, it was the memories that are the most important, but we did take a bunch of pictures. So this one isn't uh, all video like uh, we normally do, but you know, our first bear hunt, we did all with pictures. That's when we started to do our videos. Yeah, that's a very first And that first one was really cool. I like yeah. that one too. So this one will be a little bit different. It'll be a combination, a little bit of video, a little bit of picture, and we hope you like it. Yeah, and here we are now. <laughs> yeah, we are in, the pot. in January. We have <laughs> the moose in the pot above the fire, and uh, then heat that for lunch. That's gonna be good. <laughs> All right, so now it's time to eat our soup, and uh, we want to thank you for watching. We really like it, and uh, if you like what we do, give us a thumbs up, a like, and uh, subscribe for more video. And uh, don't forget, go outdoor and leave your adventure. Cheers.